you open to debating flat earth. No, I'm more so interested in debating square earth. Have you ever heard about square earth before? Now that's the heat right there. Square earth. I've also debated triangle earth before. Now triangle earth. Whoo. Now triangle earth might have something going on. I'm going to be real with you. Triangle earth. Like, okay, listen to this. If you're a flat earther, if you're a flat earther, and you, if you show, well, let me show you this. Flat earthers believe in triangle earth. Let me show you this shit right now. Flat earth. Let me show you this. Let me show you this shit. The earth is a triangle. Let me prove this shit to you real quick. That's why the, and that's why the pyramids are triangles. That's why the pyramids are pyramid shaped. They're triangle shaped. Because the pyramids are trying to show you the shape of the planet. So hold on. That's why there's also three of them. They all, they all point. I'll, sh I'll show you. Hold on. Let me, let me prove this shit real quick. Let me, let me prove this shit real quick. Hold on. I'm about to show you why the earth is a triangle. Now, I already got all the calculations that prove Earth is a triangle in my back pocket. Y'all know me, Seth the Programmer, Power Scaling Mutant, Mathematician Genius, uh, College Professor, uh, at least a 250 plus IQ. You know how I am. I've already calculated all this. I've already proven it all. But let me just show you proof that Flat Earthers believe in Triangle Earth. Hold on. So this is a, this is a picture of Flat Earth. Now, what's one thing you notice about this planet? What's one thing you notice about this planet? That shit is a triangle upside down. I'm just saying. It's an upside down triangle. It always has been. It always has been. I'm pretty sure that's a cartoon. <laughs> Damn, you're really smart, Flat Globers. You're very intelligent. That's a cartoon. Dude, I think I just got debunked. He, wait, wait, wait. Flat Globers. Wait, Flat Globers, let me ask you a question. Prove that's a cartoon. That is an extraordinary claim. An extraordinary claim. Prove that's a cartoon. Prove it. How do you prove that's a cartoon? Go for it. Prove that's a cartoon. Prove that that picture is a cartoon. Re that's a reverse burden of proof. You claimed it's a cartoon. I never said anything about its state of being. Reverse burden of proof. Prove it's a cartoon or concede. Prove it's a cartoon or concede. Can you prove it's a cartoon? Because I never claimed anything about its state of being. You did. So prove it's a cartoon. I'm smelling some burden of rejoinder here. Woo! What's the Flat Globers came in for some smoke and he got beat up in three seconds. That's weird. Weird, huh? I don't know about that. You claim it's real since you provide it as proof since you make one making the claim. I didn't say anything of the sort. I said, this is what Flat Earthers think the world looks like. That's all I said. Then you said it's a cartoon. So prove it's a cartoon. Come on, Flat Globers. Prove it's a cartoon, buddy. Why are you ducking? Why are you ducking? You can't prove it's a cartoon, can you, dumb motherfucker? You know, okay, you know, you know what I just did? Prove that is what Flat Earther thinks Flat Earth looks like. Okay. Here you go. Here's a website of them talking about Flat Earth and what Flat Earthers believe. There you go. Some Flat Earthers think it looks like that. Hey, guess what? I'm a Flat Earther. I believe that's what it looks like. GG. Anyway, prove it's a cartoon. Hey, are there any Flat Earthers in chat that think that's what Flat Earth looks like? Does anyone think that Flat Earth looks like that? I don't know. I, I, I think a lot of Flat Earthers think that Flat Earth looks like that. Yeah, look at that. There's some Flat Earthers right there. Whoa! Now prove it's a cartoon, dumb fuck. So this is what flat earthers do when they debate.
They try to push the burden of proof on you infinitely because all they can do is debate with skepticism because they feel empowered by skepticism. Because skepticism is the most pseudo-intellectual way of debating that empowers retards to sound smart. So when you put skepticism back onto them, their brain malfunctions. They don't know what to say. Some, that's a generalization. You only said prove some of them does. I never said every single one of them does. I only said some of them. I said flat earthers, and I proved flat earthers did. Now prove it's a cartoon, dumb fuck. Prove it. Prove it's a fucking cartoon. How are you going to prove it's a cartoon? Go for it, man. You literally said some. Let me see. You just said... Prove that is what Flat Earther thinks Flat uh, Flat Earth looks like. I'll put it on the screen for you. This is what you said. This is what you said in your broken English. Let me put this on the screen, buddy. Let me show you what, what you just said to me. This is what you said to me, Flat Earther. Is this not what you said? Is this not what you said, buddy? What? Uh-oh. Prove this is what Flat Earther thinks. Uh-oh. When did you say everyone? What? Oh, 4K. Whoa. It doesn't matter if it says some or every. You didn't say every either. It's an equivalent negation. Now prove it's a cartoon. Why are you ducking proving it's a cartoon? It sounds like a burden of rejoinder to me, buddy. Am I smelling a burden of rejoinder? I don't see it's a cartoon yet. Where's the cartoon? <laughs> the premise was it's a cartoon. Where's the cartoon? <laughs> he tried to reverse the burden of proof, yielded that, and now he's saying it's a fucking cartoon. Then he said every flat earther when that was never his claim. Where's the cartoon? <laughs> you skeptic fucking idiot. Dude, you debate the most moronic fucking low IQ fucking debate style and you think you can come in here and throw fucking hands, you dumbass. I already debunked that. I need to prove it's real. I already debunked that. Now you're just going back and forth. You're literally just repeating a debunked claim. Prove it's a cartoon or you yield. Prove it's a fucking cartoon or you yield, buddy. We've already been over this. The whole chat's watching it. I've already been over that. <laughs> triangle like why are y'all so mad that the earth is a triangle what what's the what's the problem with it being a triangle what, why does it matter i'm just saying the pyramids of giza just line up and i just think ancient humans think that it's a triangle that's all i think like, I don't know. What do you think is the best, uh, why, why do you think is the best way to deal with the reverse murder proof? What I just did. You just call it out for what it is. You just have to explain why it's a reverse burden of proof. Because that's what he did. He tried to reverse the burden of proof because flat earthers only debate with skepticism. So if you try to push skepticism on them or they have to prove anything, they start to fail because they don't know how to debate. You're the one who said that claim that is what flat earthers believe. I did prove that flat earthers believe that. I never said every flat earther, and nor did you say I had to prove every flat earther did it. Once again, you're off topic. Prove it's a cartoon. This is your last chance, or else you're just doing you're just doing ad nauseum. Like it's just ad nauseum and burden of rejoinder if you just keep repeating yourself. We've been over these claims. You just rewording it with broken English is not an argument. Prove that it's a cartoon, or you yield the discussion. This is your last chance. Yeah, no, he is a legit flat earther, but he's just awful because flat earthers are just skeptics. And skeptics can't debate when they don't have skepticism. <laughs> prove we exist. How do you how could you even prove that my my sense of reality is even the sense of you? How could you even prove that this picture looks the same for you as it does for me? If you cannot prove every flat earther believes it, no, that's totally, how is that even valid? That was never once stated by anyone or a claim. And you said, prove it, you said, it is, it looks like a cartoon to me. So I said, prove it's a cartoon, you're going to do it. Once again, this was never claimed by everyone, nor did I ever make that claim. So you're just saying nonsense. Do you concede? 
This is your last chance. I'll give you one more chance. Prove it's a cartoon. You just repeating yourself, repeating debunked points, and reversing burden of proof or things that were never claimed is not an argument. I know you're a flat earther and you only know how to appeal to skepticism, but use your brain for three minutes. I want you to go into jeopardy mode. Hold on, we'll hold on chat. Wait, wait, wait. Flat earther, don't type anything yet. Listen to this. Hold on. I'll play the music for you, okay? I got you real quick. I got you real quick, okay? Really think this one through. Think this one through, okay? seconds left for your answer. Okay, he has answered. Because I assumed you said that's a real picture since you'd ever, every flat earther believes that. No, sir, that is not what I was claiming, nor did I say anything of the sort. You assumed that, and then you reverse burn to proof. You said it looks like a cartoon. I said, prove it's a cartoon. You said that you tried to reverse burn to proof to prove it. You didn't. You lost the debate. GG. Thank you. We can move on now. Your assumption was incorrect. Goodbye. Anyway, moving on. The earth is a triangle. <laughs> Dude, I need to start debating again. I'm too fucking bored. I just ripped into a random flat earther <laughs> for no reason. For no reason. Like, why did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I gotta go piss. No, no, you can't just say find the artist or Google search it because I would just say prove that the artist didn't take an actual picture and isn't being threatened by the government to hide up their actual claim or their actual picture they took or actual evidence that it's true and it's just claiming it's a painting. I just say something like that. Skepticism just does any bullshit. Anyway, I gotta pee.